The experiment related to the production of biodiesel actually emerges from a student project here at IIT Bombay that was an initiative to design and assemble a biodiesel plant. Now, biodiesel is thought to be one of the new fuels that may substitute traditional petroleum-based diesel. It is purportedly less toxic and more biodegradable than traditional petrodiesel. It can be um, produced from animal fats, algae, as well as oil from plants such as rapeseed, mustard, jetrefa, and sunflower. It can also be produced from waste vegetable oil. Now there are ethical issues involved in, in the production of biodiesel from, and biofuels in general from plant sources. These are related to land use priorities and the effect that using land to produce fuel will have on food prices. Therefore, the biodiesel plant at IIT Bombay uses only waste vegetable oil as its feed. The experiment concentrates on the production of biodiesel from waste vegetable oil. Waste vegetable oil is usually contains uh, fatty acids and triglycerides. We convert this raw material into biodiesel using a series of steps. Initially, we convert fatty acid to biodiesel by reacting it with methanol in the presence of sulfuric acid as catalyst. This step is called esterification. After esterification, we transfer the content in the reactor to a settling funnel. We remove the settled methanol and the remaining material is mostly triglycerides. We convert this material to biodiesel by reacting it with methanol in the presence of potassium hydroxide catalyst. This step is called transesterification. Since potassium hydroxide might react to form soap with the acidic reactants in the mixture, we mix it with methanol to, pro uh, to produce potassium methoxide. Then we transfer it into the reaction mixture. The final product after transesterification contains mainly biodiesel, glycerol, and methanol. We remove the, the glycerol using gravity settling and methanol using atmospheric distillation. Finally, we perform vacuum distillation on the remaining product to obtain pure biodiesel. Uh, once we get biodiesel, we check its quality by performing various tests. These tests include the measurement of density, viscosity, pH, cloud point, pore point, and flash point. After these experiments, students will get a tour of the pilot plant, which produces biodiesel.